Hi, welcome back to Bible of the Year. In the New Testament, we are in Jude. And um, a lot of the letters today are from Jude, to some of God's people, and to us today is a reminder about standing firm in the faith. And a lot of the uh, tools that the writer Jude uses to do that is by talking about what happens, what it looks like when people turn away, and what godlessness looks like, and what wrong decisions look like. And he's talking about this reminder, you know, come on, contend for this, stand firm in this, it's worth it, you know, all of these things he's saying is just hold fast. And I love more than anything about this whole book, I love the way it ends, because having said all this stuff about hold fast, you know, I want to remind you, this is what happens when it goes, when people make other choices, and it ends with a, with such a brilliant focus. What are we holding fast to? And rather, who are we holding fast to? And in this last section, it says, we're holding fast essentially to him who is able to keep you from falling and to present you before his glorious presence without fault and with great joy, to the only God our Saviour, be glory, majesty, power and authority through Jesus Christ our Lord, before all ages, now and forevermore. Amen. And this is the reminder of who our God is. He's the one who's able to keep us from falling. He's the one who's able to present us into his glorious presence without finding fault. Um, he's our, our God, our Saviour. He's glorious, majestic, powerful. He has authority. That's worth sticking to, isn't it? And then in the light of that... Um, Hold on a minute, darling. Um, in the light of that, sometimes we wonder first, um, we wonder who who we are. And not to go into all of that now, but just to say, there we go, someone's joining me for this. If we want to know who we are, we first look to him. And when we look to him and understand a bit more about who he is, and as I said, Jude today ends with just a little bit about how amazing God is. Well, it starts with um, saying, and this is who we are. It says, we have been called... We are loved by God and we are kept by Jesus Christ. What a brilliant beginning and end to the book today, reminding us of who God is and reminding us of who we are. We are called, we are loved and we are kept and that is worth holding on to. Have a great day, see you again soon. God bless.